What a surprise, what a surprise. We got Vance on the mic. Yes. Man, I forgot you commentated. It's crazy. Yes, <laughs> yes. it is I, Vance. <laughs> I, I, I do the commentary. <laughs> do the commentary. Oh, I hit this man with the tassel and I put him at the corner. <laughs> oh, man. So, game one of this set. And all this shield pressure and like all this all this short neutral stuff coming in like these these footsies. Yeah. Nito like running back and forth trying oh. to get him with the, these little forward tilts. You kinda have to watch them for a lot of like can't hit boxes too because the thing about them is like they have a little they're, they're not as disjointed as you would think they are, but they got some disjointed. And, it, and it's only fair, right? Because if they were actually on the feet, they wouldn't be that great. Mm -hmm. oh. oh. Has a he has a bit of a disjoint like also with that up tilt. The I mean mm -hmm. the the strong up tilt. His whole upper body is actually completely invincible. Yeah, strong jab. Oh, and Charlie with the core. Oh, great the eye. pair. Oh. Man, he had that feet ready out there in play. Oh, man, that up smash would have caught him, though. Stuck in the ledge, but Nito opting to jump away. Oh, the double, double Yeah, double hill is going to connect. Such a good call out, too, because he knows the first thing he's going to do is come down with focus attack. Mm -hmm. So if you have more than one hitbox, man, that's a perfect way to get rid of it. Yeah, Charlie hitting him with the splits to just close out that stock. I feel like Charlie's grab combos have kind of been like a hair off today. Like he's always getting the right percent with the forward air. He's getting the combos when he tries to go for the grab. He's just been like a slight hair off and unable to get it. Mm -hmm. Both oh. these players are going to Summit, by the way. <laughs> yeah, congrats. I say this. Oh, shout out to Rival. Rival actually going to Summit too. Yeah. I'm jealous. Yeah, uh, Nito getting into Summit because of uh, Armada. And uh, Charlie getting into Summit because of Isan. Yeah. Charlie deserves it, man. He needs that level up. Mm -hmm. Summit, Summit is like the double EXP weekend for Call of Duty. Yeah. That's what it really is. You level up so much. Ooh. Falling off the platform? You know how weird it oh. is. Oh, got him with the confirm. I mean, he had, him at the, he, had, he had him at the corner, so either Charlie committed to getting out of there or he was going to get, like... It, it's tough. It's tough, honestly. Yeah, yeah but... Ken There's has a weird, like, property, right? When he, like, falls off the platform, if his opponent's under him, he actually auto-turns around right before he lands. Like, yeah. right before he, like, falls off. It's weird, and he hits you with the fair. And not only that, like, you can't really cross up Ken. Mm -hmm. Oh, God. That was a Street Fighter, like, combo there, and he mm -hmm. literally just put this man at death percents if Ooh. Charlie's Lee is not impeccable. I'll hit this man with back air. Off the stage, sir. Oh, hit him with under. So he, you unfortunately like extend your hurtbox out there when you go for things like angled four tilt. Uh -huh. Watch yourself. Yeah, don't pull out anything. Oh, that fair caught him, and he di'd in. That was bad di coming in from Charlie. Too much, too much being in the air. But I felt like Charlie was looking for the ground, and then the one thing I would have loved to have seen Charlie is once he held, holds the lead, uh, go for blaster. Mm -hmm. A little bit. You don't have to go for it as much, but like just put it out there to see how Nita reacts to it, and then bait out. Mm -hmm. A reaction using blaster, that would be a really good option for Charlie to start implementing just a little bit, not too much. Yeah. Aside from that, you kind of kept the close uh, edge guards there. Like I said, he unfortunately put his hurt box out there, so yeah. that up B was actually, I'm sorry, uh, sure you was able to stick out there and hit him. I, I'm pretty sure, like even if he didn't throw it out, it it just goes very far. It's like that yeah. Marth property, mm -hmm. where like when Marth is pressing up B, it just goes through the ledge and it just has a massive hitbox. Yeah. So, like, even if he didn't throw out that forward tilt, I think it would have still hit him. Yeah. yeah. Oh, why? I mean, Charlie does have a Mario, and he's kind of been practicing the character a little bit. Oh, dead. Good. No. Why? Oh, that he, is died, he died wrong. <laughs> he actually died wrong. You can actually DI that, and you'll be fine. Oh, uh, he died it wrong. No, I, like, maybe. Because, like, well, Nero does have, like, a a hard time against Mario. He's been losing. Yeah. He's been losing to like Jade Slayer. It is, it is a character that actually Jayslayer. like does give the the Shoto characters a bit of a difficulty. Yeah, like because Ken is kind of combo food and he can't really contest most of these moves. Mm -hmm. Like once Mario like crosses him up, he has to go, he has to go for an up B like as a true punish and like or a down tilt sometimes. Oh, oh man. Good parry too, man. He sensed that like from 30 miles away for a tilt. Uh -huh. Looking to tech chase him all the way across the stage. I mean, at this point, he gets advantage with it too. Yeah. Open back air. Four tilts. <laughs> Trying to contest <laughs> it, like spacing him out. Oh, actually missing out on the confirm. That would have been death right there after yeah. hitting that bear. Can you believe, man? One of the one of the signature Capcom characters loses to one of Nintendo's mascots. Yeah. That's crazy.
What a world we live in. Down throw. Ooh, oh, nice. that was such a good opportunity, but man, you never forget what your opponent's favorite tools are because he will use them against you every single time. Mm -hmm. Hitting him with uh, that heavy jab. Come. Waiting him out. There's oh. a forward tilt. Couldn't get a confirm off of it. Actually trading with the bear. Oh, Ooh. that was close. That was a good read coming in from Charlie, but he was just a little off. There's a oh, and the sweet spot out of it too, man. He got stuck on all of it. There was nothing he could do. Yeah, like he just, he uh, Charlie thought he could contest that true show you, but like is completely destroyed at the at the palm. What and a changeup. I'm, I'm sorry, that was really good because he down throw to down air, mm -hmm. and Nito was probably expecting forward throw. See, he, he was going to get caught by that DM and stuff. Yeah. Went for the forward tilt, not really getting that one in heavy jab, but not the prox jab. Nice heavy up tilt. He, and notice how Nito has been um, like dealing with the, the Mario, like going with these bears. He's using that heavy up tilt because all of that, all of his upper hitbox becomes completely disjointed. Yeah. It's it's a really good anti air tool in this matchup and. Nito is oh. not like not trying to deal with Charlie's uh, pressure, so he's using that forward tilt to space him away, and that's kind of what Mario's uh, biggest issues are: is like dealing with those awkward disjoints, almost dying. He's off stage. What is he gonna do? Great, that, that, was, that was great to go for the back air that far off too, because mm -hmm. it would have been meant death for Nito, and he kind of had to come in for the high recovery at that point. Oh, missed the proximity jab. Oh, went for a Tatsu, but it was negative on hit. He's flooded. What's he gonna do? Double bear? Oh, he has no jump. This is really yeah. bad, but uh, Charlie was recovering and got him a little oh, too high. That was, that was really overzealous. I felt like yeah. the grab would have been oh, better died? on the back air. He that died. It. That r he got him with the uh, raw bear. Yeah, and it's the same situation that it was last game. Charlie spent a little bit too much time in the air, and then when Nito finally kind of met him up in the air to air, he was the one winning the battle there. Yeah. Um, Charlie had a really good idea going for backup, but at that point, like, I kind of want to say, even though Nito might go for Tatsu at that side, mm -hmm. instead of focus attack cancel, like, he should still kind of hold back and then see, okay, my second time, I want to hold the stage and then go from there, instead of, like, risking that much of an option there. But, I mean, he's going to go DK. Yeah. Is he going PS2 is the question, and yes, he yeah. is. PS2, like, Donkey Kong's favorite stage. You, where he... Yeah, you don't want to give him the stage, period. No, but... Like, but who knew Charlie was gonna go DK? Look, real facts. Like <laughs> history, history will, will tell you for sure, man. You don't fight the Russians in winter, and you don't fight DK in PS2. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, getting him with the medium, uh, uh, show you, instead of going for the heavy one. Actually, oddly enough, the medium one has more knockback. <laughs> yeah. And the thing about Ken's uh, Tatsu is it doesn't kill you; it has a multi-hit, mm -hmm. and Ryu's will. Oh, going for the forward throw instead of a down throw. Man, he chucked this man off the stage, man. He said, you never belong in this game. He Another did. one, yeah. Told him, you, yeah, you're right. He doesn't belong. Hitting him with the shore, you can. Get off my stage, man. I'm the one here, uh, center stage. Winning oh, that's death. Method. Goodbye. Yeah. Don't get touched. Big Don't body. roll behind me. Yeah, big bodies will get caught by that in easily. Like, it's going to be, it, it's going to be tough because Charlie cannot cross up this character. He can't roll behind. It, as soon as, like, he's put into like the shield pressure there's basically no escape because of how giant donkey kong is yeah and the nature of the character so, oh watch yourself man no. he got hit by the sour spot he was saved by his double jump mm -hmm. <laughs> no he's good he's good yeah uh oh missed out on that one. Oh, he wanted to grab hit him with uh hit him with the roundhouse oh, oh there's that he missed he didn't get the prox jab because charlie sdi the hell out of it away Yep. Hashtag back there's air. Put bear. him on the stage. Nice raw bear. This is a, a solid edge guard here for Charlie. Can he find a grab or a reaction here? Nice. He holds the shield. Backs off. Uh, find throw. No, oh. he missed it. Oh, too much rage. He probably miscalculated yeah. it. Yeah. Tatsu not going to find that. And he just bared him. He, how dare he recover low against Donkey Kong? Oh, there we go. This did, is, this did, is, yeah, this is blow for blow, even for even. Yeah, he definitely did the. He definitely did a normal like sure you can right there, just the regular upbeat. Miss grab. Yep, Hadouken. Just contesting both players, just playing a patient neutral. Oh, going for the Tatsu. These up airs, Needle loves catching you on PS2 with those like with up airs. Just keeping on that platform forever. Oh, the shield pressure. I feel like he should also should angle the shield to avoid probably getting shield broke. Mm -hmm. Up air. 
Wait for the landing, but he goes for the back, unfortunately, on the platform, and that almost confirmed. No, the issue is if he did angle his shield in, he would have broke it. Like, yeah, oh. Yeah, the damage. Like, yeah, angle you'd rather get shield poked. And there we go. Up, there, there goes the up tilt to uh, proc jab into Shoryuken to get the stock. Yeah. And that's going to be 3 0. Oh, Nito favorite moving on to losers' finals. Mm -hmm.